international Jonah international isolation regarding his scorched earth genocide policy in Gaza yeah international isolation regarding yeah Israel's already isolated if that's your question uh, Jonah there's no doubt Israel is never going to recover from this it won't like here I'll give you an example of Israel collapsing and how desperate people are to get out of Israel flights out of Israel right now or a few days ago anyway they used to be a few weeks ago they used to be anywhere between 500 to 700 dollars flights out of Israel right right now I haven't double checked this I only have one source for this I came across it flights out flights out of Israel are anywhere between three to five thousand dollars now right because people are shitting themselves there's videos of them actually pissing themselves while Israel sent the missiles they didn't realize that it wasn't Zionist sending missiles to them so they weren't really in danger because Iran hit military bases they weren't gonna hit civilian bases right so flights out of Israel are kicked up basically eight to ten fold coming out of Israel okay that's how screwed Israel is same with companies they're skipping out according to the Durant uh, Alexander Alex Alexander Alex one of them I keep on confusing <laughs> the one that's living in Cyprus he said there's a shit ton of people from Israel and Lebanon going to Cyprus right now where you you you'll have a hard time finding Airbnbs and and companies are moving out of that region as well so that whole area it, Israel's a Titanic is going down the question is who's gonna go down with it do we want to go down with it the Western world I don't want to go down with it and I don't want those fanatics in my neighborhood I don't I don't want Zionist fanatics to flood into Canada I really don't I hope they go into Europe sorry your European friends I hope they go to Europe okay uh, I don't want them coming here they're psychopaths they're okay with genocide what the fuck right that's crazy 